Hey YouTube, it's Mr. Wills up 2000 here with the, with my 171st video. Um, I had quite a mishap in the last one, like my last try on this video. I couldn't actually, yeah, I couldn't really record it because, like, I lost my connection to the host in GTA 4, which I'm playing right now. And oh crap, this is an infernus. Yes, yes, yes. Sorry, I get. I get really fucking excited when I see an furnace. And sorry, I just said that for it, guys. Holy crap! I can't even keep up with that damn guy. Oh crap, I just hit someone random. Oh! No! No! No. But anyways... Um, I just love the Infernus in this game. I know that's a completely random topic, but... I love the Infernus. I can't even find one right now. So I'll take this guy's car. Thanks for the Corvette, which they call a Coke Weddy or whatever. Okay, so nice cars in GTA 4 that you really want to have but can't because some asshole blows them up with their hacking skills. In GTA 4, I've experienced uh, how many hackers? I don't know, but it sucks when you have hackers on your party, your land party. Because I've been. Hang on. I gotta check my controller battery. Okay. I've had so much hackers, like a girl named Morty333, her name is spelled M-O-R-D-Y-333, you know. She would hack so much that I had to almost quit the game because I could, could not, like, defeat her. I could not, like, you know, I would always shoot a gun at her, she would, like, somehow, like, shoot me and I'd die, like, instantly. It's like, no, this is stupid. But then... My friend, he was like, go, 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 go. So I take it in front of us that looks exactly like this. And it's high speed, so bear with... So I, like, I'm at the airport, and I'm like, boom. She, like, goes, like, a lot of feet in the air, because keep in mind, she's a hacker, and hackers can do that. And she's perfectly fine. She doesn't lose any health. I'm like, are you kidding me? So... My friend, the my friend, Central Two is cool one thousand. I wish she was here right now. Said, okay, then just let's let's just get that bazo the bazooka from the uh, the helicopter. These helicopters and multiplier the annihilators will give you a free bazooka. I love it. I remember this one video I made. I found thirteen of thirteen in furnaces, all different colors, in a parking lot. I'm like, this can't be a car spawner. They had to spawn by themselves. <laughs> But back to Morty333. She destroyed all my furnaces that I was driving, killed me in the process in the whole damn game, and she just was a total bitch. She got she had like every weapon. And at one point she got into my car and I'm like, oh hell no. I just take the car, I park it, like I just get to a stop, I blow it up, and she finally like quits the game. Morty333, she just quit the game, I'm like, oh, hell yeah! Me and my friend had, like, a miniature party afterwards, because she had, she had to leave the game, because apparently, you can't, like, I don't know if you can hack online with your PS3, but, if you can, then that'd be neat. So, I'm not gonna keep this video, like, at 10 minutes, because my flip video's batteries are, like, I don't know right now, so. Yeah, I found this in furnace, as you guys saw, beautiful car. And that's another topic I want to talk about. Beautiful cars that you get in GTA 4, but have them blown up. Wait a minute, I already talked about that topic. Sorry. Okay, I'll make another topic then. Um. Oh, damn. Uh. Lost and Damned add-on. Good or not? Um, the Lost and Damned add-on, yes, it is good. It's only like 10 bucks on the PSN PlayStation Store. My friend, Sanctu 2 is cool in thousand. I'm mentioning his name every second now. He got me the demo because he had like um, $10 left on his PSN card. He's like, are you sure you want this? I'm like, yes. So that's where we found all the thir 13 or 14 in furnaces. We're like, and when we got back to that parking lot, it was daylight. They weren't there. I'm like, no. I was pissed, but hey, I still had my old furnace that I was using. But... This game is like friggin' awesome. I'm gonna have to upload this to my PS3, so if it's bad quality, I'm sorry because I'm not allowed on the computer. I'm actually grounded. 
so I can't actually be playing GTA 4 right now. What was up, Bazooka? Now, weapons in GTA 4 games, like the Ballad of Gay Tony and all that. In the Ballad of Gay Tony, you can have a... You can have an explosive AA-12, like, explosive rounds. And you can have a double barrel shotgun and a combat shotgun and, um... The Lost and Damned. The Lost and Damned was pretty good because you're a biker and you can like go anywhere in the city because I think they're afraid of you in the game. But in the Battle of Gay Tony, in the Battle of Gay Tony, you have to work your way up like Nico did, I think. In the Battle of Gay Tony, you had um, golden a golden Uzi from Yusuf, I think that was his name. I'm not sure. And that's only my and the AA12, and that's all I can remember. And somebody else just joined my our party. Cool. But. I'd rather have the Lost and Damned add-on. First of all, first reason, because it's $10, not 20 like the Ballet Gay Tony. Because these are the full games, too, for the add-ons. The add-ons are the full games, which I love. But, first of all, costs too much money for the Ballet Gay Tony, and less for the Lost and Damned. Second, the Lost and Damned, you can easily find one of these babies. And I don't know if you can in the... Uh, Valley Gay Tony. Third reason, um, you can go anywhere in the city in, in um, Lost and Damned, because you're a biker, I think. And in the Battle of Gay Tony, you have to work your way up like Nico did. But, yeah, you have a lot more weapons. Like, you can have a pipe bomb in the, in the Lost and Damned. It's that awesome. Now, another thing I'd like to talk about is... Stupid trolls on YouTube who just got their accounts a few days ago because they finally found out about YouTube. I had this asshole named like Modman something something. I'm not like, I'm not trying to forget his name. I actually am actually. But I don't want to like hurt his feelings or anything. He said I suck. So I'm like, okay, then I, this is just a little asshole troll. Of course I reply to him, but. With the help of my friend Jackson, oh, it was a really good thing that I replied back to him. You see, my friend Jackson is awesome. He knows a lot about...